Hey there, it's Elise, and we're just about ready to go in for dinner, but I had to take a moment and share with you some thoughts about our day two challenge. You're not a stuck person. I know you. You have been very successful in your life. And sometimes when we're faced with something new, taking the next step, we get a little afraid. And when we get afraid, we get stuck. So depending on how emotional you are about what's in front of you, you might be able to take a step back, take a bird's eye view, and ask yourself, am I afraid? Am I uncertain of the next step? Do I just need a person who can get with me on what is the big vision? What is going to take me to my North Star? I like to call the big goal, the, the goal that you know that you are called to live out in this world, your North Star. So what I want you to do is ask yourself every single day, if you are in this place of being stuck, you can apply this at any point in your life, ask yourself every single day, what is the number one action that I can take to move myself towards that North Star? Then you set your timer for 20 minutes and you get into action. It's a mind trick that you can play on yourself because we can all do anything for 20 minutes, right? And so ask yourself, what is it that I truly want to accomplish? What is my North Star? This could be your big picture goal. This could be taking care of the sick, taking care of orphans, contributing money to that school in India. Maybe it's contributing to your local food bank. Whatever it is that you want to contribute towards, it's going to probably take some money and it's going to probably take stepping into your purpose so that you can create that success so that you can support that passion. So do you see how we can connect these dots? Can you see how when you stay small and afraid and stuck, you're not actually helping the causes that you know that you're meant to help? So this is an important time to reflect on where am I stuck? What's coming up for me when I try and get into action? Do I procrastinate? Do I go scroll Facebook or go shopping at Target and buy needless things? <laughs> right? We all have these things that we do when we're stuck. So I just want you to think it through and write about it, talk about it. Maybe you need an accountability buddy. Find one in the group. Be that girl. There are lots of women that are willing to take this next step with you and put themselves out there. I'll start a thread in the group called Accountability Buddies. You guys can connect with each other. Just go on. Um, maybe you share your name. You share what you're passionate about. You share if you're stuck and you're looking for an accountability buddy. Okay? So I'll see you over in the group. The link is below. And I am certain that this is going to move you forward. And we're going to focus a little bit more deeper tomorrow. So stay tuned for day three and stay excited about this because you're going to move in the direction of your dreams. These five days right here are going to be pivotal. So thanks for joining in on this challenge. I'm really looking forward to seeing your comments in the group. And just know this. I love you. I am for you. I've got your back. And you're my soul sister by choice. I'll talk to y'all soon. Bye-bye.